Ladies and gentlemen, welcome. It's react time, baby. And we got Simon and Vic. What's the video today? Eight prison meals in different countries of the world. Uh, Can I just preface this by saying JJ's really excited to watch this? Yeah, <laughs> like, like, for the last hour he's weird, been talking right? about how excited he is to watch this video. Well, I mean, I, I was thinking like, shit, like it might be a good way to get free meals. You know what I'm talking about? Like if and then we told him he's an idiot. <laughs> well, if one of these countries, if, if, if the food actually bangs, I might have to go over there, do a couple, you know, chefings and that. Do a couple. <laughs> what well, I mean, eat the meals that you've chefed up for yourself because you're a good boy. Okay, cool. Yeah, yeah, right. yeah, yeah. And yeah, then, yeah, yeah, and yeah, yeah. then, all of, all of a sudden, your boy's eating good. <laughs> you know what? You could probably just go to prison if you asked it. Like, you could go and like do like a docu series. I'd love to see KSI in the world's toughest prisons. Could you imagine? If it's if it means I get a break, then yeah, I'm down. <laughs> <laughs> get a break. Yo, I just need a week off. So I need to prison. Yeah, shit. I, what, what can I do that can just something get... Something minor like shoplifting or something. Yeah, I, might, a week. Just, I just need a month. Maybe a month. Then you can rap about it as well. You can be like... Yeah, exactly. Time. And then the black community will respect me. <laughs> oh, dear. All right. Anyway, On with the go. video we go. Hello, everyone. Hello. We all know very well that breaking the law is not there worthwhile. A few centuries ago, if you were caught after committing a crime, you were imprisoned in a damp dungeon with only bread and rats running around you. But something must have changed, right? In some countries, prisoners enjoy delicious food and spend their free time on creative activities. While in other you places, whole album. the conditions are still very harsh. Are you ready to <laughs> well, take that's a risky it. journey through the that world's prisons? That will be my, my, my next music camp. In prison. Oh my god. Bro, you need it's... to stop. You need no, to stop. No, no, no. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. <laughs> China. You might have heard many terrible player. stories about Russian prisons. It's difficult to say which of them are true. According to the internet, this is what a typical lunch in a Russian prison looks what like. Wait, good wait, thing the images don't evoke smells. The have you lost your disgusting stew? <laughs> do you want to go there and do a chef in? Uh, <laughs> it looks like a like a fish stew or something. Looks grim. There's got to be one nice one. Russian prison but looks that's like. what happens it's when a good you go thing do the like. images don't evoke smells. <laughs> have you lost your appetite for several days? <laughs> We have a solution. Welcome to a Chinese prison. What would you like to eat for dinner tonight? The menu includes roast huh? and shredded pork with green pepper. Uh, Tomorrow you can enjoy lamb uh, soup or uh, chicken nuggets. Look at this dish. It looks like a typical meal in a Chinese restaurant in any metropolis. By the way, if you have money, you can uh, order extra food uh, every day. Or you can buy different foods in the cafeteria. There are plenty of treats for all tastes. And so that prisoners won't suffer too much time from the heat, they're served watermelon hey, in the yo. summer. But don't think that this is the case everywhere. This only happens in the prisons of the richest Chinese cities. In smaller cities, only $1.7 a day is spent on feeding each prisoner. What can you buy with that amount of money? Inexpensive vegetables such as cabbage and radish. They're cooked in large quantities at the same time. Okay, so you need so to go to the rich part of China. Of the resulting Dude. brew is distributed in cubes and probably just looks like the ugly soup we showed you at the beginning. Italy. Have you ever seen the movie Goodfellas by Martin Scorsese? Surely you remember the scene where the gangsters enjoy a sumptuous dinner in prison. You think it was a figment of imagination of the director? Not at all. Italian law allows many prisoners to have a small gas stove on, which they can okay, make steaks yeah, yeah, and yeah, pasta yeah. and prepare I'm coffee. However, no, but you have to make it yourself still. Ah, uh, true. <laughs> May as well do that in a nice apartment. Yeah, good point, good point, good point. However, this is an option that not everyone uses since the dining room feeds the prisoners very well. The main dish consists of 120 grams of pasta or rice with sauce, 150 to 200 grams of meat or fish, vegetables, and a couple of slices of bread. Do you okay, maybe you still go with more sophisticated? Yeah, bro, you can order half a still sounding quite nice. Much more sophisticated? You can order half a liter of dry That's red wine okay. or a liter of beer. That would be will a way to, to get pay. by. Although, why buy wine when you can make it yourself? No joke. In the prison of Gorgon, there is a small vineyard and the 100 inmates held there are trained in winemaking. Wow. Don't you think that's enough? There's also a prison in Italy with a restaurant. It was created to train the prisoners and increase their chances of finding work in the future. But the criminals worked so well that the In Galera restaurant was open oh, to the I've public. Seen it. And now what? 4.5 stars out of 5. This is another video we've done reacts to. Which prison Wait. 
So yeah, so all the like waiters are inmates. I rate that though. That's good. That's good. Like, hey yo! I, to, I put myself a flight to Italy. You're acting like you don't have a chef, bro. <laughs> you have a chef in your apartment. You have <laughs> 500 fantastic restaurants nearby. Why are you going to yeah, Italy? It's a, it's a different experience. Okay, you're crazy, bro. Uh, five stars out of five on TripAdvisor. No wonder. In which prison could you try Taglione al Nero de Seppia? Japan. Are there any crimes committed in this country? Unfortunately, even in a developed country like Japan, there are people who break the law, but their numbers continue to decrease every year. Today, the crime rate is incredibly low. Perhaps that is why the Japanese authorities spoil prisoners so much. Do you remember how prison dining rooms look in the movies? The workers serve an unfathomable porridge to the prisoners. Ugh. Well. Who have trouble eating it with a spoon. <laughs> Let's make out this clip. <laughs> but to Japanese prisoners, this sounds incredible. They're used to a healthy and balanced diet. Thinly sliced oh, daikon radish, parusame noodle salad, hey, rice yo, boil, and That looks like my nightmare, but uh, it, I can understand how it's nice. This is not the menu of a fancy restaurant, but a standard lunch in a Japanese prison. When was the last time you ate roasted fish? Prisoners in Japan eat it every day. The officers think this food helps the prisoners to be better people. Do you think it really works? Kazakhstan. Ready for the most extreme tour of your life? Right, well, well they don't have dinosaurs in yeah, Kazakhstan. I'm like, what is <laughs> <laughs> Whoever edited this together, they were on something, I'm telling you. Fuck you know. What's going on? <laughs> I'm supposed to. Let's visit a place where even journalists can rarely what enter. What was the point of the that? entrance, you get an alarm button in case of an attack. The location of this shady building was not chosen by chance. It's built on a rock so that it's impossible to dig a subway passage. Moreover, the prison is surrounded by miles of steep. Pay attention because we are inside the Black Golden Eagle, one of the strictest prisons in Kazakhstan for dangerous offenders. About 100 of them will spend the rest of their lives inside these walls. These criminals have taken the lives of more than 400 Damn. victims and are now sentenced to life imprisonment. Do you want to know what a day is like for these people? At 6 o'clock a.m., the alarm sounds and the prisoners must get up and cannot go to bed or sit down until the oh end of the God. day. For 16 hours, they can only write or read on an iron table. They also have one hour to walk down a small corridor, where the ceiling has been replaced by a grid through which they can see a small piece of sky. It's forbidden to communicate or work, and every day is similar to the previous one. If you consider the terrible crimes committed by the prisoners of this prison, it's a pretty fair punishment don't you think? Norway. That's mental, Yo. You know? I, I genuinely could not think of anything worse than that. Like, yeah, I know they've done one. horrendous things, but my goodness. That is, yeah, that is horrific. But two, they didn't tell us anything about the meals there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Like that's the video we're wa we're watching for a video, you know. Look, you guys got clickbaited because we got clickbaited. Okay, we're all yeah, in this together. They're too busy like talking about dinosaurs. Like what? Fuck <laughs> <laughs> you know. Oh, this is gonna bang. This Imagine is gonna slap. an island with yeah. a Scandinavia the got the best like on a prisons. postcard. You can see <laughs> little wooden cottages, a pine. No, no I trust. trust. This is gonna be good. This is gonna be good food. Beautiful places for fishing. What's the name of this place? We want to spend our vacations there. Shut up and take my money. Sorry, KSI but it's not like. possible because we were describing the Norwegian prison of Bastor. You won't end up in this place for running a red light or committing petty crimes. This island is home to the yeah, country's bro, most. We reacted to this as well. You probably think that this place is surrounded by machine guns and a wall of barbed wire you haven't guessed Damn, right the prisoners live look at that laptop, the laptop bro they got a better setup than me <laughs> fucking they got a laundry bin hey yo they could probably record youtube videos imagine one of them in goes the into this they can visit as each like other a murderer and they come out like a league of legends champ <laughs> <laughs> And at night, only five guards patrol the place. In their free time, they're not only allowed, but also recommended to ride horses, fish, and play Bruh. tennis. Are you hungry? You can shop at the supermarket, or you can enjoy a salmon cooked by a I chef. Know, but don't think that the Italy trip. He's <laughs> going to Norway. I'm going he's going, Norway. He's going, he's going horse riding with those. Jeez. <laughs> Fucking hell, bro. That's what I need. 
I literally need a break. Give me that. You can enjoy a salmon cooked by a chef, but don't think that the Norwegian government has gone crazy. What? The that, job that, of the prison is to help people, right? Bastoy is the perfect place for this. The reoffending rate here is it just works. 16% against the European average Jeez. of 70%. What? Besides, 16 against 70. Of work, there was yeah. only I would do another crime, so I end back up here. This looks fun. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Like, surely they would... It, that doesn't make sense. I don't... But they still they still don't have any freedom. They're taught how to, like, live, like, a normal, balanced life but, without freedom. And then when they can go and... Because, like, a lot of people that end up in prison is because they've never, like, had, like, a normal life experience or learned anything or been, like, helped. And so they go to prison. It's horrible. And then, like, they end up on the same path and they go back. But their, uh... their idea is if they, like, teach people life skills they'll leave prison and they won't come back because they'll actually learn how to integrate properly and not be a criminal. Jeez. Damn. Mate. You should be a warden. Sidemen Sunday, we each go to a different prison. You spin a wheel. Oh, <laughs> and, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Instead of a holiday, we'll go to different prisons. This... Yo, I'd, I'd go prison for, for like... Uh, well, what, for... <laughs> different, different prisons in the UK. Yeah. And what are you doing uh, there? Away in group. So vlog. There's like vlog. a good prison and a bad prison. I mean, obviously. Yeah, but what are you doing there? Are you like living Vlogging. like a prisoner? Yeah. All right. Well, I'll organize the video. And <laughs> oh yeah. yeah. Guys, All right. Guys put, me the, put me on the good. Put me on the good prison. Yeah. <laughs> no, we'll see. We'll yeah, see. We'll yeah, see. We'll see. <laughs> yeah. Well, you know, one of you is going to Norway. The other isn't. <laughs> Besides, in 38 years of work, there was only one escape attempt. Why would that prisoner do that? United States of America. In movies, prisons in the United States all look very similar. Tough prisoners in orange uniforms, a gym in the courtyard, and a dining room where you can eat as much as you want. Well, U.S. authorities claim that the last point is an accurate depiction of reality. Breakfast includes oatmeal, cereal, and milk. Main courses include chicken, lasagna, and of course hot dogs, hamburgers, and burritos. Wow. Are you a vegetarian? In the United States, they respect your beliefs, even if you break the law. Since 2016, federal prisons have been offering vegetarian food to inmates. They've even developed a special low-sugar, low-salt menu to take care of the health of offenders. It's like a summer camp for kids, don't you think? However, prisoners claim that it's not all that easy. In some states, the number of meals was reduced to two a day. Some prisoners ended up eating toothpaste and toilet paper to help what? the hunger to subside. Oh, no. There were also complaints against the largest private provider of food to American prisons. Criminals have found garbage and even larvae on their plates. After oh. all, no one expects the criminals to be fed foie gras, but that's too much, don't you think? Jeez. Germany. It's gonna be Look at good. This beautiful university campus. New buildings, a picturesque forest around it, a lake nearby. It'd be great to study here, wouldn't it? Oh, oh wow. <laughs> But if you look closely, you can food. see a wall around the perimeter. Then you realize that this is not a college campus, but a prison. Although it has something in common with universities, prisoners here learn to live in a new way. Prison conditions are similar to those in the outside world, even for the most dangerous criminals. The cells have normal doors, and all prisoners have keys. Do you want to hang bright drapes and put some flower pots? No problem. You can make all kinds of renovations. But don't forget about your yoga class. Huh? You heard us right. There are also crocheting and drawing classes and outdoor volleyball games. Of course, this has lowered the reoffending rates, but we're a little upset. The prisoners are having more fun than many of us, and this news will make you feel even worse. In 2016, a food contract deal fell through. <laughs> the administration ordered food from McDonald's for the criminals. Although the inmates couldn't choose a Big Mac because it was too expensive. You know what? <laughs> so there is a lower reoffending rate, but also imagine how angry you'd be if one of these people had like done a crime to you or like someone you knew. Yeah, and yeah. then like, they're just, they're just like living a normal life in-, in If anything, living yeah. a better like, life. Yeah, potentially. That's, that is the crazy other side of it. It's like, what is the right answer? Comment section. Are these prisons too nice or not? Or, or, or are they good? Let us know. South Korea. Okay, no matter how good the conditions in prison are, no one in their right mind would want to live in this place voluntarily. However, some people are willing to pay to end up in a cell. JJ? This strange situation <laughs> happens in South Korea, but this idea seems crazy only at first sight. The country is known for its work culture, and many South Koreans suffer from stress and even have health problems from working too much. So where can you escape from this routine? In jail. Although it is a fake one, because no one would pay $90 a day to be in a real prison, especially since real prison 
prisoners are fed kongba, a traditional Korean dish made of rice and soybeans. Otherwise, the fake prison completely imitates a real prison. Visitors spend 24 hours in solitary confinement without Whoa. communication, a telephone, a Whoa. clock, or even mirrors. Many clients claim that it's the best rest of their lives. Yes. Would you like to try it? <laughs> yes. I've canceled what? my trip <laughs> to Italy. Oh my God. I'm going to South Korea. <laughs> I need a break. <laughs> Maybe there's a niche in this country. I'm gonna set up a, a prison for people that haven't committed crimes. Okay, it's like really? being that, that, that's probably would do quite well. Like I'm sure a lot of people would want to experience what it's like to be. I think you. I, I couldn't think of anyone other than you that I know, JJ. But anyway, yeah. Um, yeah let us know also in the comment section. Would you volunteer yourself to a uh, fake prison? Let, let us know down below. Um, leave a like. And see you all soon. Don't go prison. Please. Thanks, guys. Peace out. Peace.